Hey, it's John Albridge, uh, Team Posky, Real-Time Fishing. Tonight I'm going to show you another one of my cures. Real simple cure, one of my go-tos. This one I prefer a lot because it makes a brighter bait. And what I'm going to do is mix a couple different colors of Barac uh, Fire from Potsky's. Real simple to do, and I'll show it right now. So what we're going to do, again, start with a well-bled egg. Uh, get all that blood out. We'll put it right into a Ziploc bag. Okay, I've already butterflied these open. Simple process. What I'll do is put them in my Ziploc bag, set them in there. First thing I'm gonna do, I've got the orange, Baraxa Fire, and I've got the pink. And what this does, you know, the pink's a bright egg, but you put a little bit of that orange in there, it just makes the egg that really, really pops, um, just glows. Okay, simple deal. Same like my other video. I'll take some orange to start. I've got a bag of it that I pulled this off my boat, so we're just gonna use that up. Again, it's all by sight for me. There's probably a quarter cup in there. Same thing with the pink. Okay, all by feel sight. That's probably good. With the Boraxifier, you can add more cure. It's not gonna burn your eggs a little bit, a lot. You could put a whole bottle in there with two big skins, you're not gonna burn your eggs. So don't worry about that. Um, my last in ingredient I'm gonna use is some sugar. And again, Potsky's took out a lot of their sugars out of their Boraxifier because they had some clumping issues, but for steelhead, they like a sweet bait, so I add sugar, okay? Simple process, if you look in there, we've got pink, we've got orange, we've got sugar, okay? Pretty simple. What I'll do, seal that up a little bit, roll it around, get those different colors mixed in together. So all you see, you, know, you get a little bit of pink, a little bit of orange, and then right in here, really, really bright. And those eggs will turn out like that. Super, super bright. Okay, again, I'm a anise, anise guy, however you want to call it. Okay, Mike's only one to use. It's gonna be Lunker Oil. This is old bottles, old labeling. Still a great product. I'll add a few drops of the anise. Okay, then my other one for steelhead that I really, really, really like is the sand shrimp oil. Same product, it's gonna be Lunker Oil. And we'll add a few drops of that. Just like that. We'll seal this bag up. And we'll let the good times roll. Get all this pure mixed ground into these eggs. And get into all the flaps of those eggs. Okay. We'll let them sit for a little bit. Really, really simple process. You don't have to do much. Keep an eye on them. Again, you're not gonna burn your eggs. There's no sulfites in the fire. It's their steelhead cure. It's the best on the market. Um, again, play with them, roll them. Be gentle. You don't wanna pop the uh, membranes of the egg. Just work it, work it. Again, I just set them on a flat surface. Throw them down here, I can see the skeins again. All that cure is getting in there, mixed in well. And just within minutes, they'll start to milk out, okay? Don't be afraid of that. They're gonna milk out, and then they're gonna suck that juice right back into the egg. And that the oil, the Mike's oils we put in there, it'll be in that membrane of that egg. When that fish hits, they're gonna break that membrane and all that scent's gonna come out. That, the smell that draws the fish in. Really, really simple cure. Anybody can do this. All right, here we go. I'm gonna show you my mixed color, my pink color, and explain to you what's happening here. We just put the cure, the mixed orange and pink Baraxafar on these eggs. You can see they're starting to get a little wet in there. These are pink Baraxafar. These have been sitting 20 minutes, 25 minutes. Look how much juice is in there, okay? That's gonna happen. That's what we want. All those juices are coming out and it's gonna reabsorb. Tomorrow morning, I let them sit overnight. I let them sit and cure for eight, 10 hours. Tomorrow morning when I come out, they're gonna look like this again. Even though I just started these, all that juice is gonna be sucked back up into these eggs, okay? I pull them out, cut them to bait size pieces, they're ready to fish. 
Okay, so again, you're gonna see this, a bag full of juice and go, oh no, what's going on? Did I do something wrong? You didn't. This is what you want. All, they're gonna juice out, and then all those membranes, all those little eggs are gonna suck all that juice back in. Still looks similar, excuse me, similar to this. I wanna show you something. You see the difference. This is the pink borax of fire from Poskies. This is a mix of pink and orange, okay? Here's the finished product of pink and orange. Super, super bright egg. And I showed you in an earlier video how I store my eggs. This is a pint jar. Look at this. 2016. These have been in here going on five years. There's no freezer burn. There's no mildew, mold, nothing. All I'm gonna do is take these out of the jar, dry them out a little bit, come in bait sized pieces, and go fishing. Potsky products are available at sporting goods stores near you. If you can't find the specific color, size that you want, make sure to go to potsky.com. And as a thank you for watching Potsky Outdoors, we're going to show you a coupon code to be used for 10% off your next order.